Hi, welcome to my fourth um, Halloween movie horror review. So today I will be re um, reviewing an old 1970s movie, The Car. So this movie is, it's more laid back. It's not like blood and guts and gruesome. This is more like, um, it's more like a nice 70s movie, but it's about um, the sheriff and his wife and they, they get haunted and stalked by this black haunted car. So they, they obviously think there's someone driving in it, but it's possessed. So it's, um, it's a man who won't stop a large black two-door sedan from terrorizing a small Mexican, Mexican town. And the point, um, the whole point to the movie is no one knows the car's origin or who is driving it or how to stop it. And after it kills three people, the sheriff must find a way to stop this seamless, seamlessly industrial machine. The car is an oddly gripping and altogether unconventional horror film. So yeah, very good. This actor here, I'm not sure if you've ever heard of the movie, The Amityville, Amityville Horror. Um, it's James Bronlin. He actually plays in that movie too. So he's a good actor. But yeah, good movie. Very good movie. Highly recommend it. Like I said, there's no blood and guts. It's just one of it's one of a good relaxing movie to enjoy if you like haunted possessed cars. So he's one right now. But yeah, let me know. Um actually this movie let me see was made in 1977. Um, Nothing special. So it what e what evil drives the car? What evil? That's the big big question. So thanks for watching. Let me know your reviews on this movie. Why did you